you and Oscar, y'all still cool? I would say we cool. I mean, there's some things going on where we had the, uh, you know, lawsuit where they took my percentage away from uh, from Golden Boy because I fought Pacquiao. Um, that was with Richard Schaefer when he was involved, when he was the the top guy. You know, Oscar was more the pawn, maybe still kind of the pawn, but you know, I have a a good relationship with his father, Oscar's father, his family, his brothers, all this stuff, everybody. Even Oscar too. I'll sit and talk with him too as well. But Oscar's kind of to himself, and you know, he Oscar's Oscar. He does what he does. You know, he dances his own beat. He dances his own beat. <laughs> So I don't know. Yeah, I had no idea about that lawsuit, man. Because I know him and Canelo, they fell low. And I know um, he sued Ryan Garcia, which is crazy, man. But um, it's Oscar a cool dude. It seemed like his character is Floyd, man. So Oscar, he's cool, but you don't have nobody representing him, telling him, like, that, no, this is wrong. That's wrong, or whatever. Or he just, it's almost like he's going off of a whim or whatever. Like, maybe if he's high one day, then he's doing, he's doing some high stuff. You know, but if he's, there, there's nobody on his team. I remember one time I'm like, listen, man, we was out somewhere and Oscar was doing some crazy shit. I'm like, man, go get him. He shouldn't be doing that. Go get, go get that man. And they're like, oh, man, but you know, they, they don't want to do nothing. I'm like, they sitting around. I don't know, like, yes, man, or whatever. I'm like, no, that ain't cool. And he, and he shouldn't be doing that because that's how he got caught up with that fish nets and all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? Because they ain't telling them, like, yo, man, you can't do that. Stop it. And he just going off of, you know, he's in Oscar land. You know, I don't know. So that's why they say that. <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah, even with the fishnets, the heels, the wigs, it seems like he's hiding something, man. No, 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 no. He, he, he definitely, I grew up with Oscar. I've been knowing him since he was six. Seven eight years. Old. I know he ain't, he ain't he ain't that way. He just I don't know. He, like I say, he being Oscar, like he's just doing some crazy stuff. Oscar's been with all kind of different type of women, and he's he's he loves women. I know that. I've seen him around with women. I've been around him a lot. He likes women. He's just doing so. Some Oscar life. not gay. No, he ain't he ain't, he ain't gay. He just doing some he doing some weird shit. That's all. He'd be doing some weird. I'd be like, what the hell? And I was like, I, what the fuck? What, what are you doing? He'd be like, oh, man, you know, I'm just having fun, man. You know, whatever he's talking about. I'd be like, yo. But people could see and they think it's certain things. Stuff like that. But he, I, you know what I'm saying? I've never seen, like I said, I've been knowing him since he was little, with the whole family. I've never seen him with a guy or tricking out with him, trying to be in a slide tip. None of that. No gay guy in the back. This this is like like this is some cocaine drug type of shit he's doing. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and he's just yeah, yeah. But 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 he's, but but he ain't gay though. I know that. Go ahead. <laughs> I hope you're right, man. Dude was a great fighter, man. But he be doing some weird stuff, man. So I don't know, man. I always thought he was gay because of the pictures of him and fishing that. You know. No. I, I, I've never, I've never, I, listen, I was on the Olympic team with him. We used to travel all over the place, around the world, all of us, and we'll all go out and hang out with girls, and we'll all go out and like, you know what I'm saying? But not, he, they, it, okay, so it was Oscar and Raul Marquez that would be, you know, doing their thing, and then, you know, then we had like me, Chris Bird, and, you know, all the other Toronto Millettes and all the other ones, you know, St. Louis and New York. And then, yeah, all, and we all that thing. And then we all hang out and go to the club. So, I mean, you know, we all hung out. And they definitely, like, the team that we were, cause, okay, so the amateur boxing team was basically all the people in the ghetto, L.A., Detroit, New York, the whatever, Alabama, I don't know. They're all, you know what I'm saying? So we all hood people going out. Oscar, East L.A., that was supposed to be hood, too. You know what I'm saying? East L.A. So if anything was going down like that, believe me, the whole team would be like, yo, what? They would have been looking a certain way, and, they, they, you know, you would have known. You would, we, this this would have already came out a long time ago from our amateur team, all the people on our team, that he was, you know, kind of something's wrong. 
No. Oscar, Oscar would bring uh, back to the camp. He'd bring, it could be, they could be black, white, blue, green, Chinese, whatever. He used to bring all kinds of girls back to the, to the camp in Colorado Springs all the time because he always had the money from Shelly Fink or whoever. He had the most money out of everybody. He always had money. They was giving him money like for, for, for just because. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, so he would be locked up. Everybody be gambling in the, in the room. They'd be, it'd be three, four, five o'clock in the morning. They, they rolling dice. People trying to sleep. They rolling dice. Five, seven, whatever, you know? So he was a, he was a, you know, he was a real, he was a real dude. It's just that he just be doing some weird, he did weird stuff, weird, crazy stuff. Like he's just weird. I don't know. He must like it. The weird stuff. I don't know. Doing the crazy stuff. And then the whole stuff they said about him having some, they put something, man, like that's that, that's that drug stuff, man. Put stuff up on him or something like that. Oh my God. Kids stay away from drugs. <laughs> stay away from drugs, man. Especially the hard ones, man. You know, the whatever they, that, that drugs they be having that make you do that stuff. I don't want that. Don't, do not give me another. I take the, the, you know, I take the weed, the blood and, you know, maybe little mushrooms here and there. I don't know. But I, I do not want what they're giving him. Do not, I would, I, do not give me that. 